Hi guys, Nisi here. Today's DIY is this beautiful glam wall mirror. Let's jump right into the tutorial. The first thing I did was to cut my dowels to size and I'm going to be using a 48 inch dowel from the Home Depot. And I'm just going to section it off into half an inch pieces and also quarter inch pieces. So I'm just going to use my tape measure and my pencil to find my measurement. So I'm just marking my sizes and I'll need 10 pieces of the quarter inch and 70 pieces of the half an inch. And then I'll use my hacksaw to cut the pieces. And this dowel is very easy to cut. And you can buy pre-cut pieces of wood, it's just going to cost you a little bit more. And then I'll just use my 80 grit sanding paper to clean up the edges before I take them to spray paint. And I'll be using my Rust-Oleum Chrome spray paint for this. So now I'll make my design and the quarter inch will be in the center and then I'll place six around it. And the ones that are too high I just use my sanding paper to just rub it down a little bit just to get them even so my staple will go in and it will be level. And then I'll use my stapler to attach them all together. If it's your first time visiting my channel, my name is Nisi. The channel is Budget Friendly Creations. I hope you can stick around, subscribe, and turn your bell notifications on so you'll get notified every Friday when I upload a new video. And to all my current subscribers, I appreciate you guys so much for always taking the time to come and support my channel. So I'll staple the front and the back and I'll try to keep it very tight while I staple it because that's how the center one will stay in place. So now that it's nice and sturdy, I'll go ahead and apply my mirrors and I'm going to be using these one inch mirrors that I have. I'll leave a full list of all the items I use in the description box below and the link to where you can buy them if you'd like to. So I'm just going to be using my hot glue for this part and I'm trying to line up my mirrors directly in the center of the wooden piece. And I made 10 pieces of these. So we're going to be left with 10 half inch pieces. And I'm going to be using my Mod Podge to go over the top of it. And then I'll add my glitter.
And then I'll do the same thing for these pieces also. And to seal everything in and stop my glitter from shedding, I'll just water down some Mod Podge and layer it over the glitter. So after a couple hours when those are dry, it's time to apply our pieces to the mirror. And I'm using a 12 inch mirror from Michaels. I'll leave a list of where you can buy these mirrors for much cheaper than you can get it locally. So I'm just going to line up my pieces, just watch as I do it. And then I'll use my strong adhesive and I'm using Fix All along with my hot glue to apply it. So I had to flip it over in order for all of the pieces to have contact while it's drying overnight. And I'll go ahead and place something heavy on top of it while it's drying. And I'm placing it just halfway on the dowel. And then I'll just seal the edges with the hot glue and I'll leave it to dry. And to hang it on the wall, I'll just use my fix all to attach this hook. And I just clean up my mirrors and that is it. And here's the final result guys. What you think about this one please let me know in the comment section below thank you so much for watching and click on the screen to continue watching more of my videos see you next friday bye bye